हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक अगेन इन माय चैनल इंडियन फ्यूचर फोरम सो अवर टुडे टॉपिक इज चुनाव ब्रिज सो लेट स्टार्ट द चुनाव ब्रिज इज एन इंडियन रेलवे स्टील एंड कंक्रीट आर्च ब्रिज अंडर कंस्ट्रक्शन बिटवीन बक्कल एंड कुरी इन रियासी डिस्ट्रिक्ट ऑफ जम्मू एंड कश्मीर इन इंडिया वैन कंप्लीटेड द ब्रिज विल स्पैन द चुनाव रिवर एट हाइट ऑफ थ्री मीटर एबो द रिवर मेकिंग इट द वर्ल्ड हाइएस्ट ब्रिज In November 2017 the base port were declared completed allowing for start of construction of the main arch key technical data of the bridge includes deck height height above the river bed is 359 meter height above the river surface is 322 meter brick length 1315 meter including the 650 meter long viaduct on the northern side arch span 467 meter arch length 480 meter this makes the chinab bridge the world highest railway bridge the bridge with the widest span in india road gauge railway network introduction and topography northern railway has undertaken the mega project of constructing a new new rail line across indian union territory of jammu and kashmir between towns of udhampur near jammu and barmula on north western edge of the kashmir valley this project was declared a national project in 2002 it is directed by the northern railway the extraordinary challenge lies in the large number of tunnel tunneling 63 km in length and the bridge 7. 5 km to implemented in highly rugged the mountainous terrain with the difficult himalayan geology the most difficult part is believed to be the crossing of deep george of the chenab river near salal hydro power dam by the chenab bridge another similar arch bridge proposed on the new new railway line was 657 meter long 189 meter high anil khund bridge anji khud bridge between katra and riyasi over chenab river tributary river this proposal was abandoned by the railway due to the specific geology of the location and cable stayed bridge is proposed design after many deliberations taking into account athletic economy and availability of local expertise construction materials the chenab bridge was designed as a large span single arch steel bridge with approach viaducts on other side the arch is the two ribbed fabrication from large steel trusses the cords of the trusses are sealed with steel boxes internally stiffened and filled with concrete to assist in controlling wind induct forces on bridge another advantage of concrete filling is that internal painting will not be required the number of bearing has been minimized minimized particularly on approach viaduct through the use of continuous construction this is advantageous as as it reduces the maintenance and inspection effort and improve the rigidity quality the viaduct pair are of concrete while the pairs near the arch are steel the design major arch rail bridge requires considerations of number of additional parameters such as fatigue globally stability second order effects composite section extra it also requires that such a bridge is designed to achieve consistent level of reliability for all load cases and the design standard match the construction standard india indian construction standard such as indian railway standard irs the indian road congress irc and the indian standard is were founded in educate for the large span of the chenab bridge for example the indian railway standard irs is primarily intended to simply supported bridges with span up to 100 meter although these have been successfully used for higher span up to 154 meter the span for the chenab bridge greatly exceed this limit and a continuous therefore be assure safe design design the indian 
national standard have been implemented with international standards such as british standards international union of railways uic and euro also make global experts with versatile and relevant experience have been involved in order to facilitate making the project as success following are some of the design consideration taken into the account limit state philosophy of design has been decided to following as per as per bs code computation of wind load effect as per wind tunnel test site specific seismic spectra developed by indian institute of technology iit roorkee provision of euro code 8 for ductility detailing of very tall and hollow rectangular rcc pier provision of long welded rail l w r over the bridge and resulting force calculation as per uic 7743r guidelines blast resistance design used design checking for tagu as per bs code deformation limit as per comfort criteria of uic 7762r and uic 7763r guidelines re duct density provide in the structure for lower level of operation during the mishap mishaps and against collapse extreme cases of pair failure the quality aspect has been emphasized as the quantum of fabrication and welding is closal mostly indigenous material complained to is code has been planted to be used whereas the design international code have been referred which means the quality control work is still difficult construction the chenab bridge was originally intended to be completed in 2009 however in september 2008 the project was halted halted due to the fears over the bridge stability and safety work on the bridge restarted in 2010 with the plan of complete it in 2015 construction have construction was awarded to afcons infra infrastructure limited a part of sampunji and palonji group the third largest construction group in india the erection scheme for the bridge is the project in itself to pylons about 130 meter and 100 meter high where erection on either side of river R2 auxiliary self propelled cable cranes especially of 80 t each were <coughs> were used to how were used to tow temporary auxiliary ropes across these pylons the ropes were used to support the partially finished arch part after the arch completion the trusses will be added finally the girder will be constructed as a horizontal sliding type platform On July 2017 construction work resumes on November 2017 work on arch bridge to complete by May 2019 on November 2018 bridge under active construction on December 2018 project may not completed by the end of 2019 August 2019 80% work completed to be opened in mid of 2020 on November 2019 83% work completed to be opened in March 2021 on January 2020 to be opened in the December 2021 so that's all for today friends thanks for more updates like this please subscribe my channel and hit the bell button